So today I'm going to talk about the Acolyte 3. But before I get into the details, I'll start by briefly outlining the advantages of automated colony counters. Colony counters take digital images of bacterial plates that can be processed immediately or stored for later use. Another advantage of this method is that the same image will always return the same result, allowing for a level of precision that is not possible by a human operator. The results measured from these digital images will be the same today, tomorrow or even in six months time. This allows for multiple tests to be performed on the same sample without having to consider problems relating to growth, contamination or even accidental loss. Manual colony counting is a very slow and time consuming task. Our counting algorithms however measure on average around 10,000 colonies per second. This is significantly faster than even the most skilled microbiologist. Images and measurements taken on the device are automatically stored in a secured SQL database. The results of these can be output directly into a standard Excel, CSV or PDF format saving even more time and reducing the risk of input errors. Now let's take a look at the device. The Acolyte 3 is our entry level automated colony counter. It features a high resolution 1 megapixel colour camera. This allows for fast and detailed images of microbiological plates to be captured. It has multiple lighting modes that can be cycled and also two contrast plates. This range of options means the Acolyte can tackle almost any media type with ease. The lighting mode can be changed easily by simply pressing the button located on the front of the device. You have the choice between ambient, transmitted, above, and then finally a combination of transmitted and above. When trying to decide the best option to use, just place your sample into the device and cycle between them until you get the desired result. The device features an impact resistant shell and can be cleaned with all standard products such as Vercon. Access to the device can be restricted by removing the security dongle that is supplied as standard. If this is not connected, the software will not launch. Now for the software. The Acolyte uses our standard software and is capable of counting colonies on standard Petri dishes and also spiral plates. To start a new batch, simply click New Batch, then select the module you require. To set up the pour plate batch, first adjust the graticle to suit the plate size. As the colonies in this example are lighter than the background, press Total Plate Count and then Light Colonies Only. If the detected result on the screen looks correct, then name your batch and then click the measure tab and enter your first plate number. Now that this is done, you can press accept new batch and begin measuring your plates. Each time I measure a plate, the results are populated at the bottom of the screen. Once I've measured all the plates in my batch, I can then go to the results tab Select any additional headings that I require from the report and then finally click Create Report. Here I have the option between standard CSV format, Excel format and PDF format. Once I've decided I can then click Create Report. Counting on spiral plates is performed in the same way as pour plates. To start a new batch, click New Batch, now click Plate Configuration, Spiral Plates, so the spiral plate diameter allows you to select the manufacturer of your device, the spiral volume allows you to select the amount of liquid dispensed, and finally the threshold allows you to select the amount of colonies per wedge. Once you've selected your desired settings, press OK. Now select Spiral Plate. 
Now select total plate count, light colonies only. If the count looks consistent and correct, then give the batch a name. Click on the measure tab, assign your plate ID, and then press accept new batch. You can now begin measuring your plates. This works in the same way as the pour plate module. This video has given you a brief introduction to the Acolyte 3 HD. For more detailed information on each module, please see our YouTube page or website www.symbiosis.com.